It is so nice to sit here at the campfire. I really enjoy it. Now it takes not much time where, till the first snow arrived and I would love to do a winter bushcraft trip again. I love the snow. I love when the forest is covered with the snow and it is so silent then. Everything looks so so clear and clean and the voice when you um, put your shoes on the on the snow or at, at ice it's, I love it. Just great. Now the fire burns very well. When you came to the point where you had amber, also the wetter wood will burn. But till you came to the point, you had to stay constantly at the fire and take always care of the fire. Because otherwise it will not work. The wall here around the, the pieces of the tree works really great against the sparks. Here you can see it um, is a little bit too hot because um, it is black there from the fire. And um, when I make a fire longer here, I think it will also burn. I will leave the fireplace first when I can see no fire and no amber. Because when you leave the fireplace with amber, it could be that in the night a strong storm or just a fresh wind came up and then your fire can start burning again and a fire where nobody take a look at it is very dangerous. So always leave your fireplace safety. It is only after 18 o'clock, but it is complete dark in the forest, like it was in the middle of the night. At my KHS watch I can see the time also when it is dark. I never had before a watch with a watch that can glow. And I don't miss anything, but now I had the watch with the, the glowing time shower and it is great to see how late it is in the darkness. The fire is completely out and now I go into the tent. I am now into the tent. It was not so easy to go into the tent because the entrance is really, really small. I think big people or people with head hurt will have their problems to go inside here. But um, by an ultralight tent, you had to um, leave some points of comfort. And when you lay here inside, it is perfect. I think it will be very warm tonight because it, the tent is only so small. And then I could warm it up with my body warm. Um, and I go now deep into my sleeping bag and we see uh, we see and hear us tomorrow. Good night. Good morning.
Ready? Hm? Poldi? Ja, fein. Guten Morgen. Ja, guten Morgen. It is very cold this morning. I think we had maybe one degree. And at first I want to make a fire that I can warm my body and make a delicious breakfast. When my dog Poldi sleeps in the front of the tent, there is not enough place for my um, backpack. So I put on small top as a cover around it and it works as the same. I roasted for my breakfast some um, nuts and now I put honey into my pan and um, make it hot till it is caramelized and um, then the nuts came again into the pan with the honey and after doing this I um, let the, the mousse getting cold and when it is cold it is very crunchy and you can bite it off and it is so tasty. While my breakfast is getting cold so that I can eat it, I remove the tent. I sleep very well this night into the tent, it was very warm and when you lay inside you had more place, more space 
that you think. Mm -hmm. And there are some points that are very positive. Um, for example, the the top, uh, the, the, the tent strings are reflecting. So if you came with your flashlight here to the string, it is reflecting. I know so many people that fell over such tent strings and broke their arm or their leg. So this is very positive. And the big, big positive point is that you can build your tent when it is raining or snowing because the inner tent is fixed with the with the um, tent cover the the outside plan so you can lay it at the ground or you only had to bring those um, those strings on and the the inner point of the tent will stay constantly dry. This is perfect. Holly is hearing something or someone. He warned me and looks great in this right, but I cannot hear or see anything. But my senses are at the highest point. I removed the campfire place and removed the reflector wall but this time it was not really on the reflector wall, it was mere, more than nobody can see my fire. I always check where is the next way and to this point I make such an invisible firewall. I slept very well tonight in this tent. I had enough space, I had it warm, it was simply perfect. So it is an ultralight tent, so you don't have so much comfort into this tent. I um, I cannot sit um, till I cannot sit very comfortable inside because I had to sit like this. But um, it is only to sleep, and for me it is more important that I had no um, not so much weight as much comfort because the only thing I will do into this tent is sleep. I don't will spend there many times inside of the tent. So um, more, comfort, more comfort is not needed for me. So I will use it a few more times and I think for people who will only sleep into the tent or people that go into the mountains is this tent from the outdoor shop doorart.com perfect. But now I had to remove it because it takes not so much time anymore till I had to go home. And this is how it looks when it is ready. Mmm, so sweet. Mmm. <laughs> Thank you.
When I spend my time in the nature, I feel always thankful that I can stay there. So when I am for a night in the forest, I always leave something. For me it is important that I not only gi take, I give something back. And today I had here some nuts for the wood animals. And um, this is just to say thank you. This is a wildlife camera from a hunter. They had their places where they feed the wild animals. And with the camera they can check out which animals come and how many. And when you walk in front of such a camera, the hunter had also a photo from you and know that you are there or you was there. And this is not so good. So <laughs> I saw at first the place where the animals were feed and then the the hunter house where he's sitting when he is um, searching for the animals and shoot them and then I see the camera so it is not so good if you walk um, in front of the camera okay my friends now it is time to leave the forest it was a great trip now the sun comes out I wish the sun come out earlier that I can enjoy the sun too but I cannot have everything. I go now home, had a hot coffee, hot shower and maybe the next trip in the forest is with snow. We will see. So thank you for watching. Have a great time. Bye bye. This is why I need a new car. I had a completely new battery inside, brand new, but the car isn't starting. So I am alone in the middle of the forest and I had to help myself. So I had the Suaoki with me. You can, you can put there on things that need uh, high CDC and you can restart your car battery with it. And this is what I'm trying now. Goodbye, good time.